Hey guys, it's uh, Back One Hundred and One, aka Walter, here again, and today we're gonna do episode two. All right. So last time we did the tutorial. Uh, today we're gonna do. We're gonna start the Neo Challengers tournament today. <laughs> Let's get into it. Hopefully you guys can hear me. Um, yeah. Alright. So. I'm going to be quiet because there is a little video. Wow. My first tournament. Talk about competition. Bruno and LaRouge are entering. Yeah, they're just names to me. I will crush them. Uh, what's the deal? You sound angry. I'm not angry. I just don't fear weak humans. Don't freak me out. It's like you hate every Bakugan or something. Lighten up, will ya? As you say, let's battle. Okay, so what I like to do first is I check the opponent info. So, I'm going to do that first. Uh, Suji, so that's actually, pre he's pretty easy to beat. And if you look, um, it will tell you what Bakugan they're using, who they are, and right here is just a little description of them. Um, right here, where my pointer is, is their ranking points and their Bakugan rating. So this is how many points you get to go up to the rating, and then, no wait, I have that wrong, sorry. Flip them up. This one, points, raises you up, and I'm not sure about the Bakugan rating. Okay, so I'm going to read the little description right here that gives Suji. So, Suji. He lives in the same town as Dan. He has a younger brother named Akira and a younger sister named Nemi. His attribute changes whenever he shows up. He sees Dan as a rival and tries to start a battle whenever he's around. So, that's all to give you. Um, I'm going to change my deck. And then we'll get into this. Alright, we're going to start the battle. Sorry about all the zooming in and zooming out. Alright, let's see this. Second battle. Okay, so what I like to do is I don't start out with my character card, which is right there. So it says Leonidas gets the gate bonus twice. I like to go with the lowest energy first. So, right here. Oh, and if you can't see it, tell me and I will change it up for you guys. Alrighty. So, I always like to aim for my card, and I always like to use the weakest Bakugan first. Should be Juggernaut, and I'm going to use a normal attack. Or... Spit, uh, ball speed, I guess would be. Oh, and if you, I don't know if you guys can hear, but there's speakers on the remote right there. Eh, focus. 
for the Wii anyway. Oh, and if I didn't mention in the last episode, I am playing on the Wii system. Uh, so yeah. I think after this series, I will be playing Bakugan Defenders of the Core. So I hope you guys like that. So since, uh, my strategy is always, so since they've got someone on this card, I'm going to throw out another gate card, and it's going to be this one, and I'm going to throw it out right there. I'm going to use Saurus. I think next time there aren't a whole lot of cheat codes with this, but I might use some. Now since we get to choose it, sometimes I do like to set traps for him. So yeah. Alright, so he hasn't gotten on yet because he's wanting me to get on his cards. So let's go for it. Let's get on to his card like he wants us to. Leonidas, you're up. Oops. I think I can, uh, move him. Nope. Anyway, usually you can select move Bakugan and it'll move it. So if this is blurry, please tell me. Um, I need to know. If not, uh, yeah. Okay, so last video I wanted to show you guys what 2 does, but it had thought I was continuing, so I'll show you now. Okay, so what I did is, all I did was hit the 2 on the Wii Remote, which is right here. Right here. And it gives you a little information about the card. So this one says, each Ventus and Chaos Bakugan gains 100 plus G power. So, yeah. Now if you notice, with Suji right here, see his G power? He always likes to rise it and make it better than yours. So if an opponent's ever using abilities, I will move my camera. So shaking battles are again are just shaking the Wii remote. And this is pretty easy with just the beginning. Now, I did tell you guys that I would be collecting the Bakugan. I do have a sheet um, that has the Bakugan that I will eventually collect. So. Oh, and I do want to tell you guys something. In this one, I will be doing the Neon Battles. So, it won't just be one battle like last time. That was just the tutorial, and I didn't want to do the neon with it. So, each time I'll just finish a battle, like a tournament, If and if I can't, I'll tell you guys. So, let's place Leonidas's card right there. Oh, and if you guys didn't know, um, and you guys are just joining us, I am a Chaos Brawler. Uh, so I always place the partner Bakugan on their card. Now, um, I'm not advertising, but, uh, there are some groups if you're on Facebook. I will put the groups down in the description. Um, they will be down in the description. <laughs> Sorry, I can't speak today. 
will be down in the description. Um, all my information will be down there. Um, yeah. Okay, so if you guys didn't know, I am looking for all the starter Bakugan in their main attributes. Um, everything will be down in the description for you guys to know. And in this episode, tell me what you guys like about the Bakugan game and what you dislike and um, what you like about the show the first season first season and what you dislike about the show alright so let's battle okay so if I'm on my second which see right here I'm on my second G bat my gate card I'm gonna use all my abilities so you guys can see Leonidas's uh, um, ability. Now if you don't notice, on your third ability card there will always be a battle brawler on it. So like, if you're Pyrus it'll be Dan shot, if you're Ventus it'll be Shun shot, Runo shot if you're Chaos, Julie shot if you're Subterra, and so on. So, shooting battle. So this one, I'll say it again, I've got to shoot at my attribute. If I don't, it's, I get subtracted five points off of my G power. Oh, and if you're in a shooting battle and there are two of the same attributes, all of that will mostly appear will be the same attribute. So like for me it would be the only one that would really appear would be Chaos. Okay, so this is Leonidas's ability called Alpha Blaster. And I will be mentioning what I did in the last episode on every new episode. And, okay, so this screen will tell you the rewards you get for beating, the gate card reward, how many Bakugan you got, the destruction reward, the battlefield reward, the total Bakugan points. In the description, can you guys tell me what the destruction reward is for and what the battlefield reward is for? I need to know. I'm confused. So, I hope you guys can help me with that. Alright, on to the next battle. And, um, if you guys ever want to get the Bakugan that you had just gone up against, go into the park. And it will allow you to get those Bakugan into the store. Ah, my next opponent is Runo. I believe in the last episode, Runo was mentioned in it. So we've got Runo. Her Bakugan rating is 6. Her ranking points is 52370. And those are her Bakugan she's using. Okay. So here's what it says. One of the battle brawlers, Runo, is a tomboy with a lot of energy. She loves festivals and is very competitive and opination. She is usually confident, but if she loses it, she cannot quickly bounce back. Her battle style is uneven. Sometimes She's among the best, and sometimes she struggles. Runo is a chaos user and strong at controlling the battlefield and supporting teammates. My next opponent. And second battle, here we go. One. Got what I was gonna say. Sorry. We got this. I'll show you what I can do. Game start. Ah. 
Alright, here we go. Next battle. Oh, sorry. So I'm going to use low energy again. If you guys want to know what camera or anything I'm using, uh, please put it down in the description box below. I am going to go for... Oh, and over here... See where the line goes? Right here? It tells you all the Bakugan stats up in that little box. So. Oh, and I forgot to tell you guys. To uh, back up your Bakugan, hit the down arrow. So her Fear Ripper is level 300 while I'm a 170. Now usually I wouldn't have a Juggernoid um, in my party. I would have something else. I uh, can't remember, like a Serpanoid or something. So after this I think I'll go to the park. Not after this, but after the episode and uh, get something else. Rather than a Juggernoid. Oh, and in the comments, tell me what your favorite attribute is and what your favorite Bakugan is. Ah, timing battle. So, the timing battle is it'll either give you A to hit or B or you have to shake your remote. Now, that what it does is it's where, and you got to time it accordingly. So, I'll show you. Notice she's at 370 and I'm at 300. Here's what it does. Notice 466 to 508. Also, to the back favorite Bakugan and attribute, um, tell me from any season what is your favorite battle brawler? Notice I'm placing Chaos gate cards while battling a Chaos uh, opponent. Notice that she is a 240 and I am only a 180. Now she is at 430 while I'm at 370. Let's see. Um, I think I could beat that depending on what it is. Shaking battle. Oh gosh. I can so beat this. Ready? Set. Yes, I won. Player one's turn. And
and I will be placing my final gate card, which is Leonidas's character card. Oh, and the little green thing, I don't know if you guys can see it, that's over here. That is the energy that you have to control. I don't know if I showed you guys, but I'm going to do a double stand on Leonidas's card and show you what it looks like to do a spear attack double stand. So first you have to do power attack and aim, aim. And there's a double stand and see it'll say take card or move Bakugan. I am going to take the card. Oh, and uh, before I end the video today, um, we will be putting some new clothes on, and if there are some Bakugan in the store, we'll be buying some Bakugan. Oh, and tell me which, um, oh, shoot. Tell me what your favorite video game is in the comments. Alright, so now we have Marucho. He does have Prius with him. His Bakugan rating is 7 and his ranking points is 51 to 20. Alright, here we go. Marucho, one of the battle brawlers. He is the only son of, the mil of a millionaire. He likes to think before acting and is a walking encyclopedia. His battle style is based on data and information on his opponents and their Bakugan. Marucho is an Aquas user and is good at combinations of Bakugan and cards. And this is our final one and I believe there's a little video. We'll go change my clothes possibly get some new Bakugan, and that will be the end of the video. Once again, I am very sorry for the zooming in and zooming out. Tell me again in the comments if you would rather me talk through it or not. I am starting with low energy again. I always start out with the lowest G powered Bakugan. We are going to go up against Falconeer with Source. One skin, power, brawl it, and aim. I have brought his down to the same G level as mine. Or G power. <laughs> Ah, smart move, but not the right Bakugan.
If you ever want to know what a um, a ability card is used for, one skin, all you gotta do is hit the two key on your Wii Remote. We are doing a shooting battle again. Now this one I might not win. I think we will use a double stand on Juggernoid. And we will take the card again. Uh, I'm going to use a power shot on his, oh whoops, that's alright if you miss because there are shields. Wow, for gosh sakes. There we go. Um, we have now reached exactly probably 20 minutes. Um, please hit that like button. We are going to do a hashtag like spike. Bow, now, 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 bow. What is that? Alright, let's read what this skate card is. Sunspot. Doesn't give a description. But, question of the day. Who is that Bakugan on that gate card? So, he just activated an automatic shaking battle. We have a 520 against a 670. All right, shaking battle. I had reached twenty ten fifty seven. He is using Alpha Blaster again. That is what happens when you've reached the end of a, uh, I guess you could say a, um, match. So I just won that many ranking points. All I did is skip that was press A. Alright, I believe this is a video. Oh, no. Possibly after this. So I just won the golden medal. Here's a video.
If you hear the TV in the background, someone's watching TV in my house. Don't be so freaked. Leonidas did all the work. Hi, Leonidas. Nice to meet you. I'm dead. Not much of a talker, are you? He's new here, so he's not used to humans yet. Who is? I did get that Leonidas didn't come to work. The other back had gone through Dr. Michael's portal. Based on my analysis of his battling abilities and his attitude in combat, I conclude he arrived on Earth at a different time than the others. I wonder what delayed his appearance here on Earth. Perhaps he's secretly planning something beyond just Bakugan battles. Hey, what makes you say that? Yeah, relax, Marucho. You have an overactive imagination. I'm with Marucho. Tigrera said there's something weird about how aggressive he is. Maybe you should find a different partner. Tigrera is just jealous. Leo is my friend. I understand how you feel, but I really think you ought to listen to Runa. I gotta help out at my parents' restaurant. I gotta go. Just think about it, okay? Don't let them get to you. Just start thinking about your next battle. The tag team tournament's coming up. The tag team tournament? Two players battle together. Like you and me. When we win, Bruno and Marucho will come around. What do you think? Sweet. So you win? Whenever you want to practice, just come down to the park. Okay, we are going to go to the Bakugan store first. There are new Bakugan in stock. You should take a look. We've got new cards in stock. You should see if there's anything you want. Huh? Ah. I'm going to get a Bakugan and possibly upgrade. Let's see what we can get. I'm going to get Centipoid first. Thanks for shopping. Ah. And now we're going to upgrade some Bakugan. We are going to upgrade Leonidas first. We're going to upgrade his G power. Bakugan upgrade is complete. Then we're going to go upgrade Centipoid. Bakugan upgrade is complete. And finally, Saurus. Bakugan upgrade is complete. We will now go back to Leonidas, upgrade him. Bakugan upgrade is complete. I'm going to do this. I'm just going to go back until I run out of money. That is all we can do, so I'm going to exit out of the store. Thank you for coming. Time for another hashtag like spike. Put down in the comments hashtag like spike. I'm just going to. Alright, we're going to go to personal. And change my clothes. We're going to put on glasses. And I'm just going to get the simple glasses. I should change my I hope you guys liked the battle that it, uh, the the episode number two of Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Um, I will be putting uh, the Facebook pages down in the description. 
And um, remember, question of the day. Tell me who was on that gate card. Um, please tell me what your favorite attribute, your Bakugan brawler, your favorite Bakugan, uh, and every, uh, what you like and what you dislike about the game and what you like and dislike about the show. I hope you guys like this episode. Um, I will see you on the next Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Peace.